guys, I'm back and this time I'm going to show you how to achieve this really nice orange coral eye look. It's really simple as always. I'm using my Inglot palette. Please excuse it because it fell and a lot of the shadows broke. I'm going to see if I can like YouTube it. I think Michelle Fawn has a video on how to fix broken shadows. So I'm going to try to fix it. But yeah, sorry about that. It's not very cute. But this look is so nice. It's wearable for whenever you want to wear it, really. But I think it's perfect for Thanksgiving time. And I was really inspired by this scarf and just pumpkins everywhere and pumpkin lattes it's I'm gonna I think I'm gonna call it pumpkin spice but I really like this look I hope you like it too subscribe as always if you like and I'll see you in my next video bye guys so as always I'm going to prime my eyes with NYX high definition eyeshadow base Then taking the color Fierce and Tangy by Maybelline, I'm going to place this on my lids to help intensify the orange color. Inglot palettes don't provide names for their shadows, so go ahead and take an orange color and place that on top of your lid. Now taking this burnt orange color, I'm going to place this in my crease. With a matte brown eyeshadow, I'm going to blend this on my crease area and just make it a transitioning color basically. Now taking a dark brown matte color, I'm going to place this on my outer V. Then I'm going to blend all the colors together. Blend, blend, blend. And now it's time to highlight my brow bone. Now taking my favorite Physicians Formula palette, I'm going to take the lightest color and place that in the inner corners of my eyes to just brighten up this look. Last but not least, I'm going to finish this look off with some mascara, top and bottom lashes. There you have it guys, the makeup look is complete. I went ahead and placed a peachy blush on my cheeks and a neutral lipstick color. I hope you liked it. As always, see you in my next video. Bye!